I once fled a swimming pool after accidentally assaulting an old man. Hi. Well, David. <laughs> so how did you accidentally assault the old man? Um, so we were both in the pool, in the water, mm -hmm. and I had heard that it was rude to kind of overtake people, like go round people. So I decided to undertake him and go underneath him. Because I thought if you go round, <laughs> it's sort of passive aggressive. You've got to be a very good swimmer to go under well, and build up speed well, and come up the other side. Yes, that was, that was the issue. So oh. I think I went too deep. And then I misjudged it, and then I sort of came up mid-abdomen. <laughs> so, you know, you know, in, like, an ice lake, but it was skin, so I was yeah. trying to find a hole in the... You, you, you surfaced <laughs> underneath him, look, but, looking well... for a hole. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What did he do? What... He, he wasn't best pleased, Sue. He sort of struggled and then... Drowned. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what his fate was. So how did you assault him then? That's what I'm trying to well, find. Well, as I was trying to find the surface, right. I was ha quite handsy. Okay. Right. <laughs> it sounds like it was a hit and swim. <laughs> you just, you just went. An old man's undercarriage can hang very low. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if there was like an en entanglement. <laughs> Why were you so convinced that you thought it would be rude to swim round him, <laughs> but you thought if you swam underneath him, well, he so... wouldn't notice? So... When someone just appeared in front of him, <laughs> he's going to know that he has in some way been overtaken or undertaken, isn't he? Yeah. You're right. I think in his heart he would have known. Yeah. Um... <laughs> in his already weak, <laughs> aged <Yeah>. heart. <laughs> What happened to you when you got out? Well, I just looked back and he was still floundering and I just went and got changed. <laughs> what are you thinking, Sue? Mm. I, I think it's a lie because I think Alice is too kind a person. I don't think she'd have left him floundering in the pool. Right. So, basically, there's a lot riding on this now, isn't there, so? yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Because if it's true, it turns out she's a really horrible person. <laughs> <laughs> what about you, Jay? I was going to say the same thing as Sue. I don't think you're that nasty to just leave a guy. <laughs> now, now there's even more hanging on it. What do you think, David? Well, I tell you what is plausible about it. The details, the specifics, this thing about undertaking rather than overtaking, that's either been very cleverly and recently invented yeah. or it's true. Oh. You're very bold. Normally, if, if yeah. two teammates uh, are going one way, you crumble instantly. <laughs> No, I'm very happy to be outvoted. I just want to be able to say, I told you so. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you're going to say? We'll say lie. It's lovely leadership. Yeah, OK, you're well, saying it's a lie. Yeah. Alice, was it the truth or were you telling a lie? Sue's going to hate me. It's no. true. <laughs>